Stick Man by Jose Luis Franco III. One day, a boy named Joe was doing his homework. He drew a little stick man behind his homework paper. When he was about to erase it, the stick man came alive. Joe was shocked. The stick man said, Please don't be scared. My name is Stick Man. Call me Stick. Joe said, My name is Joseph. Call me Joe. Stick and Joe became best friends. After Joe finished his homework, Stick and Joe decided to watch TV. A reporter on the news said, A famous pencil drawing by Alex Brady was stolen from the museum. Joe said, That's my grandpa's drawing. Oh no! We have to find the criminals, said Stick. That night, Joe pretended to go to bed. Once his mom left his room, Stick and Joe snuck out his window. They walked to the museum, which was one mile away. When Joe got to the museum, the manager said, Sorry, buddy, the museum is closed. Oh, shucks, said Joe, and he turned to go home. Stick shouted, Joe, look in the manager's cart. Isn't that your grandpa's drawing? Yes, that is. The manager is the criminal. Let's call the police, exclaimed Joe. The police were thankful, but also not happy, that a little boy was up so late and sent Joe home to sleep. At least I caught the criminal. Next morning, Joe returned to the museum. The policeman was there and gave the drawing to Joe. Joe saw that it was ruined. The policeman said, Sorry, the criminal spilled water on it. Joe was sad and went home to tell Stick. Guess what, said Stick. I can restore your grandpa's drawing. How, Joe said. I came from a pencil and I love to draw, said Stick. Joe watched Stick fix the drawing. He couldn't believe it. He ran downstairs and told his mom everything. They quickly went to the museum and gave the restored drawing to the museum's curator. She was so grateful. Reporters came and excitedly turned the cameras on Joe, his mom, and Stick to report the good news. Joe's grandpa's drawing was saved. Funding for the 2018 Milwaukee PBS Kids Writers Contest is provided by EdVest, Wisconsin's college savings plan. Special thanks to the Betty Bryn Children's Museum and the Kiwanis Club of Greater Milwaukee.